Hi, today I'm going to show you how to make a butterfly ring. This is what it looks like when you're done. I came up with this idea by combining the starburst string and the butterfly blossom bracelet. You will need 12 orange bands, 4 pink bands, 5 white bands, your loom, the crochet hook, and a C-clip. First, take an orange band, then two orange bands, and make a V, like this. Then, take two other orange bands, make a U, like this. Now, turn that U into a hexagon, like that. Now, we're going to put two, four pink bands, two here and two here. These are going to be the wings. On this one, it's purple. Now we're going to put it on the other side, like this. Make sure it's on these two pegs. These two and these two. Now, you're going to do the same thing as a starburst string, if you ever made one. You're going to make, you're going to start here and go clockwise. Make a star. Like this. Push it all down, like that. Now it should look like this. Now, flip your loom around so the arrow is facing down. Take a white band, stretch it out, make an eight, fold it over, and put it right here on the bottom peg right there. Oops. Right there. Do that again. Stretch it out. Make an eight. Fold it over. You're going to put it in the middle. So now it looks like this. Make sure everything is pushed down. Now you're going to get under. Grab the first band under the two white bands might want to hold this down, bring it to the middle like that. Now you're going to go under, grab this band, go under and grab that band. Oops. Going to want to maybe pull it to make it over there. Now it should look like this. Now you're going to bring this band over and where it came from. See? Then you're going to do that all around. Go under, grab this band, bring it where it came from. Go under, go over, under, put it where it came from. Now it should look like this. Now we're going to do the outline. Go under the white band, bands, and grab the first orange band, which should be this band. Now bring it over, bring it to its peg, like that. Now, go under, sorry for the background voices, and go over to the orange band, to the peg. Now you're going to start going this way. See, you're going to grab, oops, going to grab this band, the last bands on your peg. Go under all of them, grab that one, go over 
and put it where it came from. Make sure that the wings aren't all tangled up in the bands. You're going to do the same thing. Go under, get the last one, bring it over, and you have to tug it, and then bring it where it came from. Like that. Now we're going to do the other side. Go back around like this. Then grab the last one, bring it over, and put it where it came from, like that. Now go under, grab this one, put it where it came from. So now it should look like a flower. Now make sure the wings are still out there, not all tangled in the bands. They're facing out like that. Now, take your hook, put it under all of these bands, all of them, don't hang on to any of them. Get a white band, hook it on to the hook, and then make sure you don't grab any other band except this white one that you have or whatever color you used. Now bring it up to the gripper. And then don't, and then pull it off. Don't be afraid to pull off the whole thing. Now it should look like this. Pull the wings out so they're not, so they don't get like tangled. Like that. Now, flip the loom back around Take two bands, put them on, make sure the arrow's facing up, and then push them all down. Now, take your butterfly flower thing, butterfly, hook this that you are hanging on to, top, in that peg. Now, you're going to hook the outline, which is this part. So it goes, this is the part that goes around your finger. Now you're going to flip the loom around. Oops, came off the peg. Again, sorry for the noise. Now you're going to just regularly, oops, Duh. it's okay if you mess up. If you mess up like that, just put it back on. Now go under, grab this band, go over, do that, okay? Now you're going to take these two bands, bring it over to this peg. You don't have to do this step, but it's easier to put hook the C-clip on. Now you're going to hook the C-clip on. Go under, hook it on, and pull it off. Now it should look like this. Get your C-clip, stretch it out, hook it on. Now take it off. The Take it off the hook, and then you have your butterfly ring. If you have any questions, post a comment, and I hope this video helped you learn something new. Bye!